tectonics. What are tectonic plates? Well, a tectonic plate, also called a lithospheric plate, is a massive, irregularly shaped slab of solid rock generally composed of both continental and oceanic lithosphere. Crest densities. There are two types of crust, oceanic and continental. Oceanic crust is very thin and dense compared to the continental crust, which is thick and not as dense. But both of these types of crust are very, very thin compared to the other layers of Earth. There are three types of plate boundaries, transform, convergent, and divergent. Transform boundaries are when two plates slide past each other. Sometimes they can get caught in pressure builds, and until the pressure is released by an earthquake, the pressure continues building. After an earthquake, things might not be in line with each other anymore. An example would be San Andreas Fault, located in California. The next type of plate boundary is a convergent boundary. A continental plate and a continental plate colliding can cause mountain ranges to form. A continental and oceanic plate or an oceanic and oceanic plate collide collision can cause subduction zones to form, and the oceanic plate that goes under the continental plate, making volcanoes. If, in this case, it is an oceanic and oceanic plate colliding, the younger and newer plate will probably stay up while the older and denser and cooler plate goes underneath. Um, when an oceanic plate goes under the continental plate, it makes volcanoes, and volcanic vo mountain ranges can form. Diversion boundaries. Two plates move away from each other. Earthquakes occur. So plates move away from each other, and they create a gap. There are different layers formed, called ranges. And when the deep crack fills with ocean water, it becomes a basin. New rock is constantly being made in rift valleys. New rock pushes and plates further apart. A very good example of this is the Mid-Ocean Ridge. What makes plates move? Well, convection currents. Convection currents powers the rock cycle and also moves the plates. Ever heard of a convection oven? Or seen a lava lamp? All of those work off of convection. The core heats of the liquid mantle closest to it, making it less dense. The now heated rock rises up while the cooled rock sinks down. The previously heated rock cools, then sinks, just to be reheated by the core. The cycle repeats and the convection cells are formed. The circular movement right underneath the plates cause them to move apart, against, or towards each other. So, we learned about the tectonic plates, the two types of crust, oceanic and continental. We learned about the three types of plate boundaries, conversion, diversion, and transform. And we learned about convection. Thanks for watching. This was a short one, but hope you stay safe.